Adobe Express sponsored this video so I can tell you about their free social media scheduler that helps you create, plan, preview, and of course, easily schedule content. When it comes to social media, balancing all the different apps, websites, etc. can be really daunting, which is why this free scheduler from Adobe Express is so helpful. The Adobe Express social media scheduler, like Adobe Express, is available via a desktop web browser and the Adobe Express mobile app. Adobe has made the scheduler free forever, and as it says on their website, no credit card is required, all you'll need is an Adobe account. If you want to start using the scheduler, check out that affiliate link in the description down below and let's head into Adobe Express. From the Adobe Express homepage here, you'll notice on the left hand side where it says schedule. We're going to click on it to go to the social media scheduler. Now luckily, the same process is doable on the mobile app. All you're going to need to do in the bottom right hand corner is click on the hamburger menu that says, well, menu. Then from here, all you're going to need to do is click on schedule and then you're going to notice a lot of the same similarities between the mobile app and the desktop version, so anything I'm talking about on this desktop version should be in the mobile app eventually if it's not there already, so we're just going to focus on that. Now the first thing you're going to want to do when it comes to any social media scheduler is you're going to want to manage your connection. To do that, all you have to do in the top right hand corner is click on manage connections, and you can see I've already made some connections. You can see you can connect your Facebook, your X, formerly known as Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, Pinterest, and your TikTok. For me, I want to go ahead and connect my Instagram, so I'm going to go ahead and click Add New. As that loads, you'll also notice it tells you how many accounts available that you can have in the scheduler. You'll notice for a lot of these, it's three out of three, so really good that it lets you know that. I'm going to go ahead and click on Connect, and while that's going, you're just going to need to follow the on-screen prompt for whatever social media you're using. For me, since I'm using Instagram, I'm going to go ahead and look at what it says I'm allowed to do. I'm going to connect via Facebook all through the Meta platform. It's going to redirect me to my Instagram. Just follow those on-screen prompts, return to Adobe Express. That's my Instagram account, and it's that easy just to go ahead and set up. Now, once you have your connection set up, you're going to want to go to the calendar. There's a couple of ways that you can actually schedule posts within the social media scheduler. The quickest way, and the way you'll do it on the Adobe Express mobile app as well, is click on this plus icon, and then from here you can either schedule stuff from Adobe Express natively, or drag and drop stuff here as it says, or browse your computer. So I'm going to go ahead and click on browse, and instead of going to my device, which is where you would drag and drop your different pieces of media, I'm going to look at some of the files. and. Eagle-eyed viewers might notice that I already have created the thumbnail for this video, so I want to go ahead and plan and create a piece of content on Twitter, for example, using this thumbnail, using this video, and if you're watching this video, a little bit of inception there for you. So we're going to go ahead and click on upload because this is how you're going to go ahead through the Adobe Express projects you've already created. From here, I'm just going to go ahead and select channels, then I'm going to either select my Twitter, aka X, Instagram, or my TikTok. Again, you can open in your connections here to add more. I'm just gonna go ahead and keep this simple and add it to Twitter. From here, I'm gonna go ahead and create a caption. So this could be something like, learn how to schedule for social media quickly and for free with Adobe Express. And I could add in the YouTube link here. So after that, if I want, I could just type in YouTube link. Again, there's, I'll show you what we're gonna do exactly. And then we can pick the date. Now, hopefully this should be going out on the 13th of March, 2024. If you're watching this in the future, hopefully past Andrew was able to get that done. You'll see, and you'll be able to keep me humble, but I'm going to go ahead and pick a time. I think a good time for my Twitter personally is pretty late in the afternoon. I'll go ahead and pick 1 24 PM. I'm also going to tweet this at multiple times. So I'll show you how you can do that. So this is now scheduled. I can either go ahead and schedule or save this as a draft. And if I click on this tooltip, it says if you're not quite finished with the post or want to save a post idea for later, you can add it or set it as a draft. Drafts won't be published. So if I hit save as draft, I can hit add draft. And there we go. I want to save this as a draft because I don't have the YouTube link in it yet, and I do want to go ahead and add that when I get the chance, but really it is that simple. And if you want to maybe schedule it or have it in an unscheduled state, you can actually store ideas for unscheduled posts. You can actually see this post I have is for Catterday. This is of my cat, Simon. 
This is one I just uploaded into Adobe Express and scheduled out. So I just wanted to say happy Carrot Day, Simon sitting on a pillow. Really goes to show the different ways you could do it. I can also post to multiple social medias if I really wanted to, but for this one, I'll just do it for Twitter. So let's say I want to go ahead and take this post that I made before, but I want to go ahead and duplicate it or even put it in the draft section. It's just as easy as dragging and dropping. Really love that functionality. Now, if I wanted to go ahead and say, maybe post this one twice, I'll click on more options here. Then I can duplicate the post and I can change what time I want to publish this. So let's say I want to set this for a little bit earlier and I want to have it at 10, 27 AM. Go ahead and click that. I don't want it today because I want it tomorrow. I'm sure someone noticed that click schedule. And then all of a sudden I have that post duplicated. This is really useful, especially if I want to post this one later in the week. Maybe I want to go ahead and post this on the 22nd. This just gives me more flexibility and options when it comes to creating content. I'm going to want to go ahead though and drag and drop this draft and actually schedule it. So as you can see, I don't think I want it that early. I think I'll go ahead and put it at 753. It is important to note that it will recognize what time zone you're in. So for me, I'm in Pacific Standard. Just wanted to flag that in case anyone was wondering, but that's how easy it is for you to schedule a post in Adobe Express's free social media scheduler. If you want to get started in Adobe Express, check out that playlist on screen on how to use Adobe Express and check out that other video on how to make a YouTube thumbnail for free. I'm Andrew Can, and if I can schedule content with Adobe Express's social media scheduler, then you can too. I wanted to thank my members for always supporting these videos and you for watching and Adobe Express for sponsoring.